The socially awkward Ranald never had a friend. He enjoyed training his pet yo-yo. <laughs> Hannah was a young aspiring ukuleleist. Although she wasn't that good, her ukulele was her only friend. She was also an enthused candle sniffer. The day Ranald and Hannah met was a major milestone that began their friendship. It started out with a simple conversation that led to an expansive variety of memories. <laughs> Ranald and Hannah started doing everything together. They played patty cake as fast as you can. And played with the new hamster they bought together, named Kip. They even tried sledding on grass. Until the day Hannah was offered a ukulele scholarship to a school in New York City. When she told Ranald she was going to leave, he didn't take it so well. <laughs> On the last day that they were together, they had a ceremonial dinner saying goodbye to each other. They embraced each other with a tender hug as they said their last goodbyes. And Ranald did an unthinkable thing. He gave Hannah his prized possession yo-yo. As she walked out the door, she clenched the yo-yo as tight as she could. It was a true keepsake of their friendships. When Ranald was looking at the Daily Magazine, he saw that Hannah was the headlining story. As he took his nightly stroll on the apartment complex roof, he bumped into a familiar stranger. It was Hannah. The occurrence that started their friendship was again recreated. As they walked along the sidewalk, Hannah stopped him and showed him the yo-yo that she'd kept for years. Friends forever.